All right, would you like to continue your story, old friends? You're going to do this together, right? Yes, sir. All right, here we go, old friends. Oh, look at the art. I love new art. Here's Gorik. All right, let's go. I like your, your cape. Thank you. It's a very shimmery cape. Thank you. Gorik, wait up. Commander, what are you doing here? Just thought you could use the company. <laughs> Seems implausible. <laughs> so, tell me about this old friend you're meeting. Yeah, Gorik, we want to hear all about Anka. An Anka. No detail. Anka? She's an old colleague from my time at Thaumanova. We had a highly productive collaboration. I mean... I may have occasionally experienced mild heart arrhythmia when we were working together, oh but as my. Blish always said, don't masticate where you hibernate. <laughs> what? <laughs> or something. I'm paraphrasing. Anyway, I lost touch with her years ago, after she left the inquest. We haven't spoken since. In Angoric, passion can mature in absence. Like an exquisite wine? <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that. Just two ex-colleagues sharing research on a problem. And Commander, we do have a problem. Tiny and I have been working on a hypothesis about Elder Dragons and magic, but with most gone, data is hard to come by. We're on Terra Incognita. Anka is offering, and we need all the knowledge we can get. Gorik, over here! It's been so long, let me take a look at you. You haven't changed a bit. Nor you. Anka, allow me to introduce... Oh, I know. It's an honor, Commander. Any friend of Gorex is a friend of mine. Quite the charmer. Uh, <laughs> right back at you. Right, right. <laughs> Feels like only yesterday we were side by side. Two interns working to push the boundaries of science. This is great. Those were the days. I meant to reach out after what happened. I did. But there was this plague, beetles incubating in people's faces. Ew. It was a long time ago. A lot's happened since then. I'm happy to see you're well, and eager to see this new data of yours. Oh, that's... Yeah... I made that up. She what? I <laughs> made it up? Well, you said... You don't have a passion for Elder Dragons? More of a... Professional interest. One in particular. I think you know her. Wait a second. She's trying to get to our read. You do want something. <gasps> Afraid to do. Me and my Aether Blades. No! What? Blades. Bye, Commander. Hey! Great to finally meet what? you. I can't mount. Gorik! They won't let me mount. Quest Natch. I knew she couldn't be trusted. Oh my God! Huh. Extra oh. The first Seriously? thing I, the first thing I tried to do is get on my uh, sky scale and go get him. I did too. <laughs> I, I just have to say, Anka looks so cool. Her character looks so cool, and her her voice actress. Oh damn! Come, champion. <gasps> we'll catch them. Orin, hold on. We need a plan. There's no time. They took Gorik. You can come with me, or I can go alone. Either way. No, I won't come with but you. I'm not staying out of the fight this time. Scion and champion. Yes! Scion and champion. Yes! Wow. Screw this guy's guy. I got Aureen. Wouldn't that be funny if they gave you that automatically? And I'd be like, are you kidding me? That's what I just did all the sky scale and I get Aureen as a mount. Right? I'll scout ahead and try to find him. Okay. Never thought I'd see those sky clowns again. No. They're not clowns, they're killers. Remember Lion's Arch? They worked for Scarlet for the love of... Oh, Gorik! They've certainly been busy. Where did they get all these airships? I don't know, but we're gonna go kill all of them. First mate, Anka has secured the target. First mate. This wasn't supposed to be a kidnapping. But I suppose the situation is what it is. Chief, what about the Elder Dragon? Captain's orders are clear. 
behind you. <laughs> he was about to tell us stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Ether blades are insidious, but for pirates, they're weirdly into data entry. Check the terminal for a map, a flight plan. <laughs> they're weirdly into data entry. <laughs> Oh, it's great. These charts, they don't make any sense. Why would the Aether Blades go to... Uh-oh. I have to get off this thing. I'm reading a lot. You don't have a choice. You're gonna have to jump. Might. I jumped. Attacking from above. This is Such so good. Might. Yes. Trinity World Ship, prepare for mischief or something. Hang on to your pantaloons. Hang on to your pantaloons. Reading some crazy energy spikes, Commander. See anything strange? Uh, if you could say that. They're heading into the mists. Oh no, I, I can't help you in crazy. there. Commander, please don't let anything happen to go. Uh-uh. Oh my god, this is crazy just cool. You and me now, champion. Maybe just you. I've no way to get to the next ship. Let me help. I think you'll enjoy this. Use Orin's power to cross the gap. Woo! Oh, I didn't do it right. Nice. Oh no. Yes. Uh, Yay! Wait. Wait for it. Wee! Oh, I didn't make it. Whoopsie. Pick up the Aether okay. cannon. Yes, please. Oh, did you pick it up? I did. Do kill you want it? No, kill him. I did. Whee! Oh, you went to the far one. I did. Yeah. This is great. Can we keep this ability the entire expansion? I know. I know. This is. I love this. I want Orin jump. Commander, this is Captain My Trin of the Aether Blade. It's My Trin. Okay. Call up Orin and surrender. No one has to get hurt. Everyone's gonna get hurt. <laughs> Everyone thinks I'm your pet. Evasive maneuvers. <gasps> Hard to stop her. I got there. <laughs> I didn't go on her ship. I'm punching her and she's not dying. <laughs> really? Oh, oh, oh hey. <laughs> it's not very fair. Oh, okay. How did you get to go somewhere cool? I'm like fighting people. No, I'm, I'm back. They kicked me off. Oh, okay. They kicked me off. There's a cannon up there if you want it. Aka to munitions. Attack. Weapons check on the extractor. Prepare for live operations. Our captain told us not to use it. Just a contingency. Make sure it's ready. Hold them off. I'll deal with the prisoner. Don't hurt him. Oh, I'm pretty sure I caught her. Okay. Okay. Can't believe you fell for that. So having fun in there, you built rat. No more. I'm trapped. Oh, Gotta be a way to overload oh, the system. Trapped. Okay. Easy, PZ lemon, squeezy. Yep. I just go around it. Oh, it's actually the one all the way over oh. there. Oh, we're not so smart. No. Oh, there we go. Airship control over here. That did it. Oh, now nice. to find the right ship. Don't leave though. Okay. Why? It says that it says that we did it, right? We gotta find the right ship. Oh, that's weird. It told me like this is not your active. I'll take care of this one. Know. Tried to end the story for me. The, the dragon. Yes, go Orin. Haven't seen Orin like this in a while. She's Randy, baby. What? <laughs> Piss off, Commander. Next ship's too far. I have to steer this thing closer. Okay. Uh, let's 
go let's go steer their ship let's steer it reposition i keep hitting g oh no it's so bad lost ark destroyed me how amazing is this gang oh i don't know what i'm you doing fall off yeah head. i just i just went okay. right off yeah that was beautiful that was beautiful i believe in beautifuls oh, oh no. what i didn't uh, even mean to do that that was great okay you go on the ship and destroy the controls yep Increases. Uh, I don't think I can. I think it has to be you. Has to be me? Yeah, it's your story. It's, yeah, it's your story. Okay, sorry. No, that's okay. Reposition. What is happening? That's crazy cool. I will say this is this is an this is an opening. This is a great opening, Mirror Bear, yeah. Absolutely. Such might. <laughs> he knocked me off. No, really? Yeah, little jerk. All right, uh, we have to get across over there. Hello. You're gonna wind up dead. <laughs> Fleet. Prepare for extrication from the mists. Initiate portal activation. No! Timey, we're out of the mists. Can you see our location? Uh, Look at this. Help. Some kind of landmass in the distance. Timey! Hello? Is that our first look? Must be out of comms range. Great. Our first look of uh, Cantha right there? Is it? Gotta find Gorik. Here he is. What do you want to know? They're below, right? How do we get below? Yeah. Here. Yeah. Oh, wait, not there. Thank oh, you. Oh, you tortured me. I this never ran. Yeah, there you go. They couldn't get a word out of me. Oh, it's <sighs> the other way. Cut free. I can't believe Anka would do this. Joining the Aether Blades? Kidnapping? Uh, what's gotten into her? We can talk about her later. Right now, we have to get off this ship. She used to be so nice. So sorry about this, Gorik. Uh, now, not so much. Aka, our people are on that ship. Hold fire. Just taking a little initiative, Captain. Almost there, Commander. Champion, I'm coming. Meet me on the deck. Dragon's heading right for us, Captain. Evasive maneuvers. I can't get there. I've got her in my sights. What do you mean? Shake it off. Avoid the fire. Walk around the fire. The fire's everywhere. <laughs> Shake it off. Fire burns. There she is. Don't do it, Anka. Don't do Three. it. No. You Anka, bastards. You <gasps> no. There is a problem, and I handled it. Commander, I think we're going down. What? What? Did we die? No. gonna steal my legendary armor you wash up on animal crossing 
It's your own island. Detention facility. All right. <laughs> I like how Gorik's in every one of these. Like, I know. Pictures. I know. <laughs> you should do a Where's Gorik? Oh, man. I think he's stabilizing. <laughs> You're on the floor next Last to me. Lee, there's a dead man right there. Is that you? Give us some more detail. That is me. Yes. The hell is that one anyway? Search me. Those teeth. Those ears. Ooh. Oh, they don't like the Asura? They don't like Gorgs. can hear you. <laughs> I said I don't know. The detective will have an update when it's all sorted out. Sit tight. Unacceptable. I want my comms call. We have a right to counsel. Not here, you don't. Yeah, I was gonna say, you're in a different, you're in a different country. Oh, thank the commander. You're awake. You've been out for uh, so much to, you won't believe where we. Uh, look at our clothes. I know, look at our clothes. Slow down. Okay, first things first. We're in a pickle. I can see that. After M noon, I swore I'd never go back in. One time, unfortunate misunderstanding. Two times, I start to question myself. Prison changes you. <laughs> I'm not built for hard time, Commander. There's still so much to learn, so much science to be done. Never even got a chance to tell. Oh. Ooh, what was he gonna say? I won't die in this cell, you hear me? I won't jail my body, but my mind is free. Okay, okay, Shang calm Sung? down, everyone. Is that you? When did Guild Think. Wars 2 get a Mortal Kombat Scrap crossover? Metal. If we find some, we can hone it into a, what is it, uh, a shiv. We have to establish dominance. Shiv. Find the biggest, most intimidating inmate and stab him in the carotid artery in front of the whole cafeteria. <laughs> oh, but if we do, then what have we become? Are we monsters, Commander? And were we all along? Maybe prison your doesn't honor. change you. Maybe it reveals you. No, we do what we must to stay alive. In the insect world, there is no morality. Only the strongest survive. And so shall we. We must be as ruthless as the beetle, as deadly as the mantis, as resilient as the roach. So funny. My goodness, he's going crazy. FPS, thank you so All much for the right bits. Outsiders. Your time's up. Okay, well, I didn't even get that. Wait, did you, you search serious? the room? They had all no! these things we can interact with. No, I was waiting until it was done. Me too. Talking. Why would they do that? All right. Well, we got the journal. Can we read the journal? Yeah. There was a journal here. It looks like they've been letting Gorik work through his anxiety by taking Fine. notes. De Dear Blish, I'm recording this for posterity. If I die here, at least my thoughts will live on free from the chains of corrupt system. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Kidnapped by someone I considered a friend, someone I... No, it is too much to think about. And now I'm the one behind bars. If there's justice in this world, it's sorely lacking in wherever I am. It's lonely here. The commander's out cold and the guards seem irritated by my questions. So I decided to write to the one person I could always talk to. Just wish you were really here. You always knew what to do, Gorik. Hmm. Day three. We've been here many days. The commander's still holding on. Today, the guards brought in some devar bizarre device. It seems to be aiding the recovery process. I think you'd find it as fascinating as I do. It emits a green light, strange but oddly captivating. I'm writing this entry under its eerie glow. I asked the guards about it, but they were, weren't were too keen on chatting. I'll try to get more out of them tomorrow. Day 7. Dear Blish, I'm starting to lose it. I swear the walls are closing in. Don't know how much more I can take of this isolation. Treated worse than an ant searching for a spare crumb or a scrap of... Ooh, lunch is here. Smells delicious. Oh, and they gave me extra fruit on my dessert today. <laughs> I love it. I, I always like the little flower they put on the serving tray. It's a sweet personal touch. We'll write again soon if I'm not too weak and malnourished to hold my pen. Dear Blish, on day nine, you don't think Timey's mad at me, do you? At least not mad mad. Not that mad. Now, not if she's being too busy worried about me, but that means I'm making her worry. Somehow that feels worse than making her mad. Um, dear Blish, the guard said the, uh, the commander's condition is improving. Still unconscious, though. This will sound silly, but sometimes when no one else is here, I chat with the commander. I know it's one-sided, but in a way, that makes it easier. I think uh, having the commander as a friend is good for me. Since we started working together, I felt braver, more confident, and comfortable. I haven't felt like that since, well, since you were around. I said all this last night in one of our little chats. I'm glad the commander won't ever know how sappy I sounded. I'm so embarrassed. Missing everyone hard tonight, Aww. especially you. 
poor Gorik. All right, there's a couple of blank pages at the end. All right. Time's up. Uh, are we being executed? What? What's the matter with you? <laughs> your friends negotiated your release. A big-headed man. Our friends? <sighs> Follow me. And no funny business. You're still in my custody. Officer, may I ask your name? Rama. Detective Rama. Uh, detective. My name is Gorik. This is I'm yeah, I don't need your life story. You washed up on my beach. Give me a crap ton of paperwork. I... Tengu. Truth is, I have at times been quite at odds with the law. In fact, oh, I was charged with bioterrorism in Amnoon. He grew a beetle in his arm. Uh-huh. <laughs> Ew. Staying busy, I Akana? forgot about that. <laughs> Best internship ever. All right, you two. Release forms. By signing this, you affirm that the Ministry of Security has treated you fairly and humanely, that you've suffered no unreasonable bodily harm during your arrest and detainment. You first, bioterrorist. Wait, <gasps> define bodily harm. I stubbed my toe last night. Sign the damn form. So Detective Rama is played by the voice actor who did Charles in Red Dead Redemption 2. Now you? I can recognize that. Love Charles. I'm signing the dotted line. You can collect your personal effects from the box there. Nice. I don't have to wear robes. Yay! This is great. Everything's new. So shiny Fantastic. and new. Keep going into first person mode. We hope you enjoyed like... your stay at the Xingjie Detention Sorry. Center. Now, if you'll follow me, Akane, hold down the fort. Roger that. Xingjie? Xingjie. I was trying to tell you, Commander. The airship crash landed in. Kantha, come for the waters, stay for the hospitality. Been a while. Did you miss us? Kantha. I, I don't know what to say. Only been 114 years. Not like you had time to prepare something. <laughs> this is I, so I just, cool. I, I just, I'm constantly getting like waves of chill. What the alchemy is that? Security mech or something. I can't keep up with all the new tech. Curiously reminiscent of our golems. Has Kantha been trading with Radisoon? Which part have we been close to the outside world for over a hundred years? Did you not understand? Oh, such you can't might. speed up. You can't walk any faster. I know. Funny. And <gasps> we're here. <laughs> Welcome to Kantha. Wow. That hit me like a ton of bricks. Great an ambassador is waiting for you. And our Minister of Security wants to speak with you after. Wow, wow, wow. Ah, I'm stunned. I'm literally stunned. I just want to look around. I know. Counselor Flun is here? Oh, now I'm less excited about the expansion. <laughs> <laughs> he literally ruined the expansion for me just now. <laughs> I cannot believe this. This is so good. You know, I also appreciate they don't let you bring out your mount or anything yet, you know? Yeah, you're still, you're, per, you're walking at the feet at their speed. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, you can't do anything. Great. Wait, now back in here, there was like a crane Tengu, right? At the beginning? Yeah, there was, there's a couple of different Tengus. Yeah, like, yeah. What is this thing? What is this thing? Tell me. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is this burp man? And why can't we make one of those? <laughs> Jake Smith, thanks for following. Do you like this guy? A little burb. A little beak. A little Have beak. You considered getting oh, I good. love that. I can't even. Oh, oh, that's great. See, they're all different. There's another one over here that's different, too. I know. Hey, Merm. He's like a parakeet man. This one. On oh. my mark. This one looks like, like a traditional tank. Yeah, there's a traditional one, and then there was a crane one. No, I mean, look, no, he's not even traditional. Like his ears. Look at those ears. Yeah, that's weird. 
He's a little freaky looking. Sean, He's UK, hard. thanks for following. Welcome, friends. How These exciting is this? This one, I this one's these. my favorite, I think. I like this well, guy. Yeah, the OG, the first one we saw, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's pretty cool. It's great. These are pretty cool. Um. Yeah, the stream's going great. No, you can't make a Tengu. No, they have no, no new playable races. Ding. All right, this is beautiful. Speed thing is killing, but what'd you say? The speed thing is killing. Yeah, we're we're, we're walking very slowly. Oh, we're going the wrong way, yeah. are we? Yeah. Oh, well, I tried to go into the water. Like the whole screen flashed white, and then it teleported back on land. How funny! It's a Tengu cousin, the Canary Goo. Oh my god, I love this one. Thanks. I really, really, really do. Thanks for uh, clipping, Arrowwolf. If you guys see anything funny or usual, any big moments today, please clip them and put them on our Discord. And if you're new to the stream, join our Discord. Exclamation point Discord. Everyone's welcome to join us over there. We talk about food. We share pictures of our pets. We talk about movies and games and music and all kinds of stuff. And we just hang out as a community. It's a great group of people. Join our Discord. Okay. Let's continue. I will say so far the opening of this whole thing has exceeded expectations. Oh, 100. Yep. Like aether blade ship hopping like what? Been crazy. Cass, Jory. I'm I'm glad you're here. I Have you heard anything about Orin? Is she She's fine. Oh, Recovering. Really? Oh, okay, good. Don't worry. Case with her. You'll see her soon. It's okay to take a moment to find your bearings. After we heard about what happened, we were so... <sighs> anyway, took a little while, but it all worked out. Sort of. I'm still missing some pieces. How did you find us? Find you? You kind of caused... A hot, steaming mess of a circus show? An what? international incident. Jenna sent me to Smooth Feathers. And no way would I let Jory miss the opportunity of a lifetime. Really? Don't know about that. Not like I ever expected to see this place. But sure, if you say so. You know it is. Commander, there'll be time to catch you up, but that man wanted to speak to you. Meet the Minister of Security. All right. Character models are so cool. They look fantastic. Okay, Minister Lee. So, you're the commander I've been hearing so much about. I guess I am. Lee, Minister of Security. Under the agreement signed, hmm, 20 minutes ago, you've been granted clemency. I suppose I've got you to thank for that? Hmm. You are fortunate to have such influential friends. My understanding is you're something of a protector of the realm. Doing whatever's necessary to keep your people safe. I try to keep all people safe. I see. Well, it is my duty to keep the people of Cantha safe. I'm very good at my job, Commander. Understood, Ooh. Minister. I must return to my duties. Welcome to the Sovereign Empire of Cantha. Well, Commander, you're almost free of me. But there's one more thing we need to do before I can sign your release. Meet me at the monastery training grounds as soon as you can. Training grounds? Yes! Rama, a word. Minister? Oh my Any god, old friends completed. Situation? Oh, he's talking. Wow. Unfortunately, no. I've been busy handling our guest of honor. But I'll be back on the case as soon as this is wrapped up. Good. Then maybe we'll finally make some headway. Detective? The Aether Blade situation. All right. Sato says heroic boosters on Twitch. Is that um? Oh, like a drop? I don't know if they're drops. Are they, is it Twitch Prime? Oh. Just 4D. Hey, what's up? All right. So the rewards for old friends completed. Oh my God! It unlocks the fishing master ring. We got Tale of Adventure, used for crafting and purchasing items. Earn daily from each story chapter. Okay. 
Old Fishing Rod takes effect immediately upon receipt. Grants 1,000 karma to Wooden Lore and unlocks the Fishing Mastery Track. A deluxe Gearbox and three bags of loot. Oh my god, stuff pop up everywhere. Mastery Point earned. End of Dragons, my first one. Fishing Hole Master reduces time to catch uh, at Fishing Holes and triples the XP gained from fishing there. All right. I guess that's the first one we'll start working on, right? Yes, sir. There's skiff piloting, jade bots, arbor stone revitalization, and turtle mounts. All right. You can now fish in the many wardos of Tyria. You now have a fishing pole equipped. You can switch your fishing pole by selecting fishing from the mastery skill menu. Fishing requires bait or a lure to be equipped. All right. We got a stash of crimson skull coins. It grants a large amount of End of Dragons mastery experience. All right, there we go. And we got a mastery point. Nice. What's in the deluxe gearbox? I guess we should click it's, it. It's it's just oh, loot. It's, it's just loot. Yeah. That's not deluxe. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Bags of loot. Oh, man, that was funny as hell. What was that other thing I just deposited? Oh, well. We didn't need it. So how do we um, equip the fishing pole? Or was it automatically equipped, they said? It's, um... Uh, Where'd they put my fishing get, pole? You get more XP. Yeah. All right. Let's, uh, let's talk to our friends before we leave. Lady Casimir. Well, you're in the clear. One less thing for me to worry about. How's the new job going, Cass? It's not boring. <laughs> Lots to learn. But I'm starting to get a feel for this diplomacy thing. I've already met several officials open to discussion. Of course, you can get some who are hesitant about Kantha opening. Don't lose sleep over a few jerks still stuck in the past. Negotiation does take dealing with all kinds. Stubborn certainly is a kind, but you'll hold your own. Have you learned anything about our new hosts? Well, I'm a little rusty on my Canton history, but things seem different from what I would have expected. Well, there was a tsunami when Zaitan arose. A lot of Kainang was destroyed. Uninhabitable. Maybe worse than Lion's Arch. Apparently filthy with Risen. Zaitan, of course. Which led to a rebellion against the Ministry of Purity. Pretty bloody one, too. Massive civil war. Who knows how long? Sounds like things were pretty bad until some Tengu holdouts joined up. Turn the tide. Maybe. Still trying to piece it all together. But yeah, not exactly what we expected. Huh. But where would the fun be in that? And who else is here? Ben says something. They uh, Ben something said. I think they said Jay's the fishing hockey. All right, I'll check check it out after this. Well, quite a few members of Dragon's Watch, Kaith, Timey, plus several Tyrian ambassadors, Sienna, Amber Doomforge, Mirren Skilkin, and some others. Snargle Goldclaw. The guy who writes romance literature? <laughs> Still, we're in impressive company. It's a little intimidating. You're not exactly lacking accomplishments, my dear. Gods, the past few months alone. I just want to do a good job. Make a solid name for myself. I'd say you've done that. I'm impressed. And a little intimidated. All right. Talk to Marjorie. How are you holding up, Commander? It's sure been a wild week. Everything's okay? Your reaction to Casimir's comment about being here. Yeah. No. I don't know. Is something wrong? It's just... I don't know anything about Kantha. A couple of heirlooms for my grandmother. Recipe or two. Like I said, until a week ago, I never had a reason to imagine any of this just wasn't an option. Belinda was the one who was so into her Canthan heritage. Should have been her here. She would have loved this. Me? 
I don't care. I think it's gonna Tori, change. I just... I, I didn't realize. Why would you? And the thing is, I don't even know why. Isn't that weird? Hmm. Did their, like, expressions and stuff change, or is that just me looking for new stuff? I don't know. Their faces look different when they're talking to me. All right. Um, I still don't understand how it is you're here. Highly implausible string of events. Out of the blue, a message from Empress Yin. First official communique from Kantha in over a century. Inviting Kryda to reestablish diplomatic relations. Oh, and by the way, do we know anything about foreign airships appearing in their skies and crashing on their beach? Imagine Jenna's face. <laughs> Imagine everyone's face. When it got to the part about a Norn, an Asura, and a dragon, we put two and two together with Tymie and Kate. Next thing you know, Ambassador Mead has a new portfolio and an airship to take her and a delegation to Kantha. Didn't know what to expect with the Risen Armada. No one has dared travel this far into the sea in over a century. Luckily, Zaitan's death seems to have left them a bit disorganized. We managed to slip past them on an airship. Handy having a mesmer aboard. All right. And then uh, Gorik. All right. So Anka, she's really something. I can't believe that's the same Anka I used to hypothesize with. Kidnapping? Murder? Swashbuckling? Tiny was right. I should have questioned her motives. But hearing from her after so long, it was as if my rational mind short-circuited. <sighs> Much like the ant's brain when infected with a fungal spore. That's one way to put it. <laughs> Certain people can cloud your judgment. True. Emotions do take over sometimes. Happens to the best of us. And what does she want with Oreen? I needed to brief with Taimi. She's going to yell at me, isn't she? Never thought I'd see Cantha. Agreed. You only crash into a research opportunity like this once in a lifetime. I find their technology fascinating. Like that apparatus you were hooked up to in the cell. I kept asking the guards about it, but they threatened to attach it to my mouth if I didn't stop talking. It's reminiscent of a golem mod Taimi and I were concepting right before I left. I hope this debacle didn't cause her too much stress. All right. Lots of dialogue. I love the I, I love know. I love talking with them. Like that was very Guild Wars one. Like you'd finish a big story moment, and then you could actually like talk to everybody and see what they have to say. Yeah. Yeah. And these guys don't talk over here. Okay. No. Sweet. I think we're finally done with the first instance. Old friends. J is the right key, and by the way, it's right under the um, swap weapon. 